Well guys, many of you that have been following my channel for quite some time now, like I said in the previous video that I made a couple months ago, I've been very familiar with this repossessed 2000 Jeep Grand Cherokee that just keeps coming back to my dad's dealership. Probably one of the worst luck vehicles we've ever had. Every time it came back, it's always had more and more problems. This has been one of the first vehicles to ever be featured on my channel, and when I uploaded it, definitely one of the most popular ones. And with the old school Sopkai Low 4 style video, basically was trying to get it running, did a couple detail videos of it, and basically keeping everybody updated on people that are big fans of this vehicle. So like I said, if you want to see a more detailed video about it, just type in 2000 Jeep Grand Cherokee on the channel and you'll see a whole bunch of videos pop up about it. But this video has been quite a long time in the making. It's finally fixed and here today for its first test and run and test drive. So I have been informed that it has been completely fixed now. So we'll go ahead and give it a test. Let's see if we can get her going finally. Now the first video I made on this was back probably about three or so years ago and it had a blown engine. Um, after a couple update videos and several months later we eventually got it fixed and sold it. Um, put a new engine in it but I never could get another video of it. Then it was repossessed again came back this time with a busted transmission and it wouldn't start and that was the previous video that I made a couple months ago so let's see if it's finally good it's got 179,609 miles beautiful Basically what the problem was, and just like I thought, thought in the last video, is a neutral safety switch, which is a um, common problem on these Grand Cherokees. Transmission shifts into gear. Fantastic. It's got the four liter power tech inline six cylinder. Still needs some new gas shocks on the hood. It's running like a champ. She's running like a champ. And I'm gonna go ahead and clean it up and get get it ready to be put on the front line a little bit later. We'll make our test drive video after I'm done. Now I'm all done cleaning the Jeep. This is actually the next day after I've reorganized everything on the car lot. Nice looking Fox body. Go ahead and move it back so you can see all the stuff that I've done to it. Headlights on right quick. See how it looks. Clean as a whistle. Still needs just a couple more things done to it, but it's pretty much done for the most part. Got everything cleaned up in the back. All the trash taken out.
much the same thing over here. Not too bad for a vehicle with almost 180,000 miles. Hey, I'm going to take that test drive that so many people have been wanting me to do. We won't be gone too long, so I'm still going to put some gas in this a little bit later. Transmission shifts out beautifully. Engine's nice and smooth and quiet. With that signature note from that straight six. Suspensions are always quite soft in these vehicles as well. They have a nice, smooth um, ride quality to them. Air conditioning's ice cold. Radio works fantastic. Definitely not a bad vehicle at all. I remember back when I was in high school when we first got this in, um, I think it was before the first, no, it was after the first time it was repoed. It had about 130,000 miles on it. And I drove it for a little while in high school while I was um, getting one of my cars fixed at the time. So I've always liked these generations of Grand Cherokees. Get a little acceleration out of it and see how it goes. Nice and smooth delivery. Drives like a new one and couldn't ask for anything better. I'm glad I was finally able to make this video after what, three, three and a half years? <laughs> this will definitely be the final update on the Grand Cherokee. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm going to see how it sounds in park. Fantastic. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this final update 
on the 2000 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Be sure to stay tuned next time. There's a lot more where that came from. Take care, everybody. And just get a quick shot of the dealership. I just rearranged and updated the Auto Trader page yesterday. Quite the full lot.